What's going on everybody? This is Island Hopper TV coming to you from Sarasota, Florida. So what we're going to do here is we're going to start out in the downtown area and then we are going to head over to the Bayfront and then over to some of the islands, the Keys, Lido Key and maybe even make it all the way over to Fiesta Key. Depends on how everything goes. But let's keep cruising down here on Main Street. It says home of the Orioles. This is where the spring training is for the Baltimore Orioles. Currently staying at the Aloft Hotel in downtown. Prices are up right now during spring break. So if you're looking to save money, spring break in Sarasota or anywhere in South Florida is not where you're gonna save the money. <laughs> Let me just say that. I've now done Fort Myers, Key West, Miami, Naples. Hotel rooms are way up. Anyway, we're gonna keep cruising this street. Yeah, so here we are on Lemon Street in Maine. This is one of the main intersections that you probably go when you're here. Okay. Madison City Grill. The Bayfront's really nice in Sarasota. I like it down there. That's where we're headed. Uh, pineapple. Let's cruise through here. The city of Sarasota actually has around 55,000 people living here. It's in Sarasota County. So it's a cosmopolitan city. Laid back, very laid back. <clears throat> All right, we've got to the Sarasota Bayfront. Old, it's been a while since they've repaired this. Lots of big boats, there's Marina Jacks. And if you go over here, there's the Marina Bayfront Park. And for those of you who know about the Kissing Sailor in San Diego, they actually have the Kissing Sailor here in Sarasota. Real nice bay though. Like I said, Sarasota's got that cosmopolitan small town feel. Not too big. Not too overpopulated. But enough for vibrance. There's the sailor I was telling you about. The kissing sailor. Alright, we've made it to the other side where the Bayfront Park is. And they have O'Leary's. Look at that. Three dollar domestic draft beer. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. It's a great price right there on the water. Still get a drink here at the Tiki Bar. Where's the entrance? That was one entrance. Let me go this way though. Leary's Tiki Bar and Grill, food and beverages. Okay. Nice. A lot breezier this time around. Sarasota. Really a special place. 
place, huh? Just want to give you this 360 degree view from the tip of the bay park at the marina. And here we are at the very end of the Bayfront Park. You can see there's like a palace over here, it's like a hotel. Look at that bridge, that's the bridge to Lido Key. Over there is uh, Siesta Key. So it looks like from here, I'm gonna head over towards Lido across that bridge. What do you guys think? Well, let's show you around this Sarasota Marina. Look at the big boats they got up in here, man. Big old boats. It's amazing. Here's the sister cities of Sarasota. You've got Perpignan, France, Vladimir, Russia, Telmond, Israel, Zymen, China, Merida, Yucatan, Lucento, Italy, Lundfermoen, Scotland. Well, what do you say about that, mighty? Okay, so we have officially arrived at Lido Key. This is the beach, and then I'll show you guys around the common area, kind of the area that people walk around. And uh, we'll walk out here to the beach and see what's going on. There's two keys out here that are real famous, Fiesta Key and Lido Key. As I said, this is the one known as Lido. Almost sounds like Lido, but there's some birds out here. People like the birds. This whole side of Western Florida has a lot of cool islands, you know, Captiva Island, Marco Island, Sanibel Island. Turtles too. Look at that house there. Okay, here we are at Lido Beach. We're walking out of here. Oh, it's a real nice beach, man. Wow. Lido Key, you got the beach. That's the spot, huh? Amazing. Look how great this beach is. Wow. All right. This is probably better than Fort Myers Beach. But it's probably more expensive. I like this. That water is very, very nice looking. Gotta have some manatees over here somewhere. Okay, so here we are on John Ringling Boulevard. That's where I just came from, which is where the beach is. And now we're gonna go down Ringling here, right up the middle of Lido Island Circle or Square, whatever you wanna call this. Just kind of show you both sides have activities. We've got a bar over here. We've got bars and restaurants over there. That one's called Daiquiri Deck. And then there's this like roundabout that's just got a bunch of nice restaurants and shopping. A statue. That green deck. If you guys are enjoying this video so far, please consider liking the video and subscribing to Island Hopper TV. Considering going to the Caribbean or Europe next some point in time I'll do both did just get back from the Caribbean I spent a lot of time down there in 2021 and Latin America this is the Harding Circle historic district you guys know John Ringling the Ringling Brothers Circus this part of Florida had a lot of interesting characters from the old 
world. You know, I went to the museum with Henry Ford yesterday and Thomas Edison, the Ringling Brothers out here. Just a circle. It's like a roundabout. I suppose I should be walking on the street, but you can see Ben and Jerry's. Landing Company, Dreamweaver Collection, Mini Donuts, Crab and Fin. Over there, you got more restaurants. Starbucks, Pizza, Alvin's Island, Crab and Fin. I'm actually going to be going that way, though. So that'll be an interesting trek. Being in the center of the village here. Let's pick up when I get over there on the actual... So here's a look at the resort. So here's the Tiki Bar the end of Lido Key at the Ritz. This is the beach at Ritz Carlton. That's where the sun sets, but we've actually had some really kind of crummy weather. That's okay. Anyways, this is the beach at the Ritz Carlton. At the end of Lido Key, you can see the buildings over there. Uh, if I could zoom in there, that would be Siesta Key. So now, we will head back to Sarasota. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this travel guide from Sarasota, and we will see you on the next one.